can I bother troublemaker? Make a nigga one I'm little hit, but still I'm making paper. Baby, you say your women nearly motherfuck them haters. Hate it. See out of the soul, we hit a battle, your hoes flow, we shot like razors. Wow. Don't sit down, I move, she can't make a chance and go, yeah, piss a cool thing, and I'm a yeah, I mean, uh, like you said, you know, I, I do, a, I'm, you know, I'm doing shows, like we're in France right now. Um, I just started a label, it's called AOMG. Um, like, you know, I'm on SNL, uh, I'm, I'm doing my own album, and uh, we're also producing for other um, artists. So, um, it's just finding that balance, you know, um, like maybe, maybe during the day, um, I'll write some lyrics or whatever for my album, and then maybe at night, I'll meet up with some people from AOMG. Or produce a song for um, someone else, and then maybe the next day I'll, you know, um, practice for the show in France. You know, it's just uh, all about balancing your time. Wow, I mean, just uh, the fact that I created a label was um, it was a very big step for me um, because you know we have a we have an artist right now. We have a um, we have artist right now. Um, Gray just came out yesterday. And um, yeah, I mean the response is very good. Um, so you know, I, I think it's just all about um, putting out good music um, and just um, building that AOMG brand. And uh, also, next step for me is obviously um, I'm working on a mixtape in English, and also I'm working on um, my album, um, which is about to come out next year. So um, right now, yeah, I, I, I'm pretty busy doing this and that. For me personally, I'm not always like on the top of the charts or anything like that. But it's okay uh, for me because I'm I'm doing what I'm doing. I'm doing what I, the music I like to do with the people I like to you know uh, make music with. And um, even though it's not high on the charts, I see a lot of people enjoy my music, which is good enough for me. I don't, I don't feel like Joel was that. The dance performance for Joel wasn't that you know it wasn't that crazy. So I don't know why I got nominated, but I'm. Competitive? No, I'm not. I, I probably won't get it. Yeah, I, I, I will probably get it, but it's okay. You know. Um. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm honored to be nominated, but um, I, I don't feel like Joe is like you know that a really dance oriented song. So. I'm addicted to winning, boy. You know I never lose. No bitches in my circle, only. Oh, that's that's a really honor. Yeah, I'm doing my best to uh, like let let word know the Korean hip hop. This is probably our first time performing together outside of Korea um, since like 2010. So you know we're, we're gonna be rocking the stage together, which is um, special in general. And the fact that we're doing it in, in um, Paris, it's my first time in Paris. Is, is it your first time performing in Paris? Yeah, I mean, so I mean, it's both our first time performing in Paris, and we're doing it together. So the fact that AOM and Illy is in Paris, um, rocking the stage together, is, is special and just in, you know, it's on its own. Oh no! I mean, I heard they don't shave here. Is that true? Or, uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure. I don't know. Is is that true? Um, no, okay, well then, no, I, I didn't really have any expectations, um, just, I know that, um, you know, it's like the, the country of romance, or is Paris the city of romance, right? And the, it's the language of love, French is the language of love, right? Yeah, so, you know, um, my expectations are very high. It's good that they shaved us. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Oh, I mean, with Chacha, you know, of course, you know, um, we've been in the same B-Boy crew for, like, years now. And then, um, you know, once I became solo and um, I had, you know, creative control of my own career, it only made sense to to link up together because he did music, I did music, his music was good. Um, I was just starting out at the time, but, you know, of course, you know, I'm, I'm hip-hop and R&B based, and he does R&B and hip-hop. Um, he does a lot of pop now, but, you know, he was, back then he was mostly R&B. So, you know, it only made sense to link up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it, was, it was fate. Um, no, but, um, you know, Doki did a show in Seattle. In Seattle. And I was there also. And then, um, you know, that's, that's where we linked up and, and kind of got each other's contacts. And then um, when I went back to Korea, you know, it was like, oh, yeah, let's do a song. Now. I was like, yeah, let's do it. Ever since then, it's like, 
Doki's the one who also introduced me to Korean hip hop because I didn't really listen to Korean hip hop, only listen to you know US hip hop. But you know, I heard a lot of Doki stuff, and I was like, wow, this is dope, you know. And then um, ever since then, I got really into Korean hip hop, and, and now I'm, I'm part of Korean hip hop. So it's uh, yeah, it worked out very well. It was like destiny. <laughs> Alien there is a hip hop label, so we, we don't go out on TV shows and we just do shows like all around the world. And we make albums, mixtapes. Yeah, that's it. When's your next album gonna come out? Uh, soon. Next month, November. Yeah, Ruthless, the album is coming out. Yeah. It's not particularly a message I want to bring, it's just like I want to introduce myself, my music, and my, my stage, and also with, with Doki here. We just want to introduce ourselves and have a good time. Because this, this is our first time meeting with everyone in, in France, you know, and in Paris. So I don't want to come here with like a serious message or anything, but it's just like I want, um, this is like the first introduction, so I, it's very important for me. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I am the CEO, um, but it's not like I'm, you know, I'm just... For me, it's like we're, we're a team, and we're all starting together, uh, and, and we're building AOMG together. It's not like I'm the CEO, so I have to have, um, uh, you know, Gray be my slave and, and, you know, work for me. You know, it's not like that. It's like we're a team, and, and um, we're all in it together. For me, uh, my, uh, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, I get, I get inspired by my life, you know, I travel a lot, and I, I go shopping, I watch movies, yeah, that's the inspiration. And favorite artist, uh, right for right now is Mick Mill, MMG. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, same for me, you know, um, of course, I get inspired by just experiences and, and stuff like that. But um, you know, I listen to a lot of music. Um, when I was younger, you know, my favorite artists were like people like um, like Usher and Tupac, and Biggie, and um, Cannabis, Eminem. Um, as of right now, um, I, I'm listening to a lot of like um, like Big Sean, ASAP Rocky, Drake, Meek Mills, of course. Um, who else? Miguel, uh, TGT, um, Doki. Yeah. So get up on my lap and. Okay, so um, yeah, right now, um, you know, hip hop, underground hip hop scene is is, is getting really, really big in, in Korea. You know, as you can see, you know, um, Doki and, and Illionaires have come a long way in just like a couple years. Um, and just people like you know, Ameba, Ameba Culture, and, and brand new music and, and highlight records and all that. Um, yeah, I think it's getting bigger, and um, people are catching on because you know, um, the, the underground hip hop scene has a lot of talent. You know, very, very talented, um, music-wise, show-wise, the shows are very fun. Um, and so people are catching on, and I think it's just going to get bigger and bigger. And um, hopefully, you know, um, K-pop, you know, you know the, the idol groups and, and even the choreography and, and the, all that, it, 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 it caught on. But hopefully, I'm, I'm hoping that overseas can catch on to um, the underground hip-hop scene as much as they did the K-pop scene. Uh, for me, uh, I don't think as a... Like like underground hip hop or like overground hip hop. Hip hop is just hip hop, so you know, you know, hip hop, hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you know, um, for the fans, um, it's it's it feels very good to be here, for, you know, first for the first time. Um, I've been waiting to come to France, uh, you know, Paris and France um, for a very long time now, and I'm glad that I could be here with, with Doki and Um I'm hoping the show will be, um, you know, a, a success, and we're gonna put on a, a great show for you guys. So, um, yeah, turn up. Once again, turn up. Thank you very much. Merci. We do what we do.